What is up, beauties? My name is Burnsy, and welcome to part two of our two-part troll. Yesterday, we made a kid cry for his mom, and today, we get to talk to the mom. And of course, you can watch this video in full high definition on your Xbox with the new YouTube application. Xbox has actually partnered with a pretty popular YouTuber in Freddy Wong, so if you want to see his promotion for the app, there's an annotation on the screen and a link in the description. So sit back and enjoy the video, and if you believe it deserves it, please go ahead and give it a like rating, and if you really enjoy it, please give it a favorite. Stay beautiful, my friends, and I'll see you later. Hello? Hello, who, is this, uh, Ro is this uh, Rosemary? Yes, it is. Oh, hi, my name is Mr. John Trolinski. Yes, I, I work for a company called, we're a third-party nonprofit company called Trollark. And basically what our job is to do is to make sure that the online game content for your children, especially Andrew there, who's only 13 years old, is to just make sure that, you know, he's not being harassed online and things like that. Uh, basically, we got an email from his uh, gamer tag, which I assume you either paid for or his brother paid for, uh, saying that there was, uh, he was playing, uh, mature games, 17 plus games, and he's under the age of 17. And I was just trying to okay. figure out, you know, what we can do to, to make sure that this doesn't get a permanent ban on the account and on the Xbox. What games are they, what games are you playing that are mature? Is it the Call of Duty? From what, Hello? from what I see, well, I guess let me introduce myself. Oh yeah, this is my, there, uh, ma this is my ahead, superior, Jimmy. Rose, is it Rosa Marie or Rosemary? Rosemary. 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 Basically, we we're the good guys. Uh, we, like he said, we're a third party company, and when when an underage person is playing mature content games that he's not allowed to play, and it gets reported, it can get pretty serious. But what we can do on our end is we can set up a workshop and we can get him through that. But I mean, we need to get some details from you and see exactly what he's been playing. Has he been playing the the Call of Duty games, or has he been playing those those games that you can get? I mean, there's there's games out there that you can get that are really really bad. I mean, we're talking pornography games. There's things like that. We need to make sure he's not into that. Not that I know of. Okay. Uh, well, what understand. What mature games are you guys playing? That's it. Yeah. There's no Do, other games you guys are playing. Can you look through his game stack and see if there's anything like Leisure Suit Larry or anything that what would? What Leisure Suit Larry? Do you guys have that? I buy them the games. Um, they have the Call of Duty. Okay. Um, they have. Uh, let's see, which is this one? Uh, they have. Resident Evil. Oh, that's a uh, bad one. No, that's a bad Resident one there. Resident Evil is bad. What do you mean? Well, bad? it's a it's a mature it's a mature seventeen content, and your your youngest son is thirteen, and he's been basically log captured playing those games, and that's that's where we step in. If we if we're not the third party or the middleman, what they'll do is they will go to his console and they will ban his console and basically lock up his Xbox to where it's it's no good. So then you have a $200 Xbox, and you have an account that's permanently banned with F Xbox. So we're trying to keep you from having to go through that. So I need to, I just need to keep Andrew from playing. Is that what you're saying? I'm sorry, I got, it cut off on I, me, John. Do I, do, do I need to ban Andrew from playing the Xbox? Well, I mean... There's a couple different situations that we could, you know, go about here. I mean, obviously you're the you're the parent. I mean, I guess it's it's really in your control uh, to what he plays and you know what he doesn't play. Um, you saw Resident Evil in there. Is there any others that concern you in that pile that you see? Um, I just read. What other game? Where's all your games? He that's that's the okay, thing. He they made... have Call of Duty. They have Resident Evil. They have Battlefield Three, Halo Three. Toy Soldiers, Cold War, EA Sports, MMA, Harm's Way, Gears of War 3, Batman, Arkham Asylum, Call of Duty, Black Ops, um, Halo Reach, Dead Island, Ooh. Modern Warfare, he had, Portal 2. He has a laundry list that yeah. you're reading off a laundry list of, of mature 17 games. Yeah. That's where the problem is. That's why he got reported because he's logged in on different games so much that that he's been reported probably numerous times. We only have one report up here, but the names you're reading off are, are very, very bad. I mean, the, the EA Sports, Someone the MMA... you, Andrew, that you're playing the, these games. And you know what? Uh, you know, I do have some solutions for you, uh, Rosemary, if you are interested in hearing them. Do you have, like, a poss possibly have, like, a pen and paper? I can kind of... It's kind of a tough process to walk you through. It's called Family Settings on the Xbox. 
Do you have a pen and paper I can help you out with this? Uh, yeah. That's okay. so strange because the one that plays with it all day is my 17-year-old. Mm-hmm. Not the little one. The little one plays with his PlayStation. I mean, well, does that... Their, um, their live is getting ready to expire. Um, okay. So maybe I should just not buy another card again. Yeah, that that might that might be the best option. Is that does that sound like a better option to you than the family settings? Does it just does that solve the pro- problem uh, yeah, better for you? I'm just not gonna I'm just not gonna buy another card. That's all. Yeah, because that, it's, that, it's on the it's on the live that the problem is at, right? Yes, exactly. And I think I, you know if that's a better option for you, yeah, I, know, I want you to have peace of mind when your kids are playing online. If if the peace of mind that yeah, if that's what gives you peace of mind so is just the knowing that them that they're not. No well, I want to I want to step in here for just a second and. We don't want we don't want Andrew to lose the the Xbox experience. Um, there are games he can play. You don't have to cancel it necessarily. You can just you can limit it. Maybe get him a separate game tag. He can play like Barbie Barbie Princess. He can play Pokemon. He can play the I believe you said um, there was a Lego game. Yeah, the Barbie and the and the Pokemon. That's he's not going to play those. He'd rather um, play the hardcore shooters. Um, I'm just not going to buy the lies. That's all. I'm going to take it. Okay. Off. I mean, okay, if, that... if this is a huge problem, I'm, I'm the kind that I, I will close everything off. I don't. I won't give them very much options. So okay. if the live is the problem, I will cancel the live. Okay. Sounds that sounds like a good option for you, Rosemary. And uh, I just want to know, can uh, can I sing you a little like Christmas song? Because I think I think you've just made my day being a responsible parent, and I, I just want to wish you a happy holidays and a merry Christmas. Is, can can we end the call on that? Can we do what? I'm sorry. I just want I just want to sing a song because it, it just warms my heart that there's wonderful parents such as yourself out there who are very <laughs> concerned and take care of their kids. It just it just warms my heart that you are just amazing. You are an amazing human being. I understand that you're single. If I was in your area, I'd love to take you out. Sound like a phenomenal person. Who told you who, that? Your son Anthony, told me that. Anthony, yeah, Anthony told us everything. He told us your dress size and that you're single and that you have brown long hair and. He was very descriptive. I don't know why. We were trying to keep him... That's why... That's... Here, real quick. Do you have information about me? They're saying they never told you anything like this. Well, what she told me as I was like... Because I was asking if uh, if you were available, and then he said that you were on the phone. I asked if uh, his dad was around. and says his dad doesn't live with you. So I just put two and two together, figured out you were single. I don't know. I was just, I was just throwing out there. I'm a little lonely this Christmas and uh, I was just, I was just throwing that out there. So, uh, can I sing you a song to, to lead us out here? You've been just a wonderful, wonderful person tonight. Okay. Um, I'll just go ahead and, uh, cancel the live. Okay. Tis the season to be trolling Rosemary. Have a nice night, Rosemary. You've been beautiful. Thank you.